Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, hello everyone. Thank you so much for attending today and I'd love to thank grad school for giving me the opportunity to talk a little bit about my research. Um, I could go on and on with the thanks, but I only have three minutes. Three. So all right, let's get right to it. Um, by quick show of hands, how many people know what a benefit corporation is? All right, so they need to do a better job. We all need to do a better job <laughs> of talking about benefit corporation. But for those of you who didn't raise your hand, that's okay, because a year or so ago, I had absolutely no idea what a benefit corporation is. And so all of these listed here are either benefit corporations by incorporation, or they have accepted a benefit corporation certification that is issued through BLAB. So traditional, when we think about businesses or we think about a corporation, we think about a company that is in business primarily to maximize shareholders' profit. However, over the past three decades or so, what we've had is a change in the tides and stakeholders are now requiring that companies not only make profit, but that they do minimal harm to the environment and also do some social good. But throughout the United States, this form of incorporating that allowed companies to do good and make a profit was not available. So what a company called B-Lab did, and they're a not-for-profit out of California, they traveled across the nation and lobbied states to have this form of incorporation available on their books. To date, they've been fairly successful because we have 33 states that now have a benefit incorporation option as a statute, and an additional six states are working on it. So as an accounting researcher, I was interested in how is success measured at these companies that have a pluralistic set of investors, stakeholders in general, and then, specific to my accounting interest, is what role does accounting play in facilitating this success? To answer these research questions, what I did is that I conducted a set of interviews with Benefit Corp execs across the nation. And so what I found is, primarily, Benefit Corporations consider success by the number and variety of certifications that they're available to them and that they qualify for and earn. And in terms of the role that accounting plays, accounting forms the backbone of the information that benefit corporations provide to these certifying bodies to earn these certifications. I'm truly excited about this topic and my time is up, but I'll be right over there for any questions later on. Thank you. Thank you.